Whether you are traveling or are at home, if you find bed bugs, you may have a significant problem on your hands. However, you can learn and implement specific control steps to identify, prevent, and eliminate these increasingly common parasites. This type of stepped approach to bed bug management and eradication is known as Integrated Pest Management, or IPM. IPM should be used in any pest situation, from insect and disease pests in your garden to household pests. IPM focuses on pest prevention by eliminating the root causes of the pest problems. It combines accurate knowledge with multiple tactics to prevent, reduce, and preferably eliminate the pests. While the primary goal is pest elimination, a secondary goal is to reduce or eliminate the use of toxic pesticides, which can be harmful for you and for the environment, and frequently result in pesticide resistance issues. How can you use IPM to prevent and treat bed bugs at home? IPM uses a multi-pronged approach. Your first step should be to prevent bringing them into your home. Therefore, taking proper precautions is important. To begin, bed bugs cannot fly, so they can only enter your home in two ways. One, by being transported in clothing, backpacks, suitcases, mattresses, or other furniture. Two, bed bugs can also walk in from adjacent apartments or rooms, and through cracks or conduits for electrical wiring or plumbing. They search for a sleeping human by moving up walls, bed linens, bed legs, or anything touching the bed. So how can you prevent bed bugs from gaining a foothold in your home? Some helpful steps include, as soon as you return home from traveling, carefully inspect clothing and baggage outside of your home. Or you can inspect your luggage in a light colored bathtub. Also, place any clothing you think could be possibly contaminated with bed bugs into knotted plastic bags until the clothing can be placed directly into a dryer and heated to a temperature of 120 degrees for at least 30 minutes. This will kill any bed bugs or eggs. Other ways to prevent bed bugs are to avoid acquiring used furniture and mattresses as they may be infested. Seal cracks and crevices, especially those that lead to other rooms or floors. Remove clutter from the home, especially the bedrooms where bed bugs can find additional places to hide. Use solid, light colored sheets. These make early detection of bed bugs easier. Keep beds clear above and below. Do not store items under beds and do not pile coats or clothing on beds. If you find that you do have an infestation, you will need to perform a combination of actions. Bed bug control is difficult, so it is best to consult a licensed and experienced pest management professional, PMP, to help rid your home of these pests. You don't want to try it yourself and have the bed bugs remain. It is very important to obtain an initial assessment of how severe an infestation is. The PMP must conduct a thorough inspection of your home to look for bed bugs and their harborage sites for targeted cleaning and treatments. They will need to inspect and vacuum mattresses, box springs, and bed frames, as well as carpets and any cracks and crevices that bed bugs may hide in during the day. After thoroughly vacuuming, they will direct you to enclose the mattress and box spring in zippered encasements that are rated to prevent piercing by bed bug bites or their escape through zippers, for example, Protect-A-Bed. Any bed bugs or eggs remaining on the mattress and box spring will be trapped inside the cover and will eventually die. Do not remove these covers. Instead, consider them your new mattress and box spring surfaces. Be very careful not to rip or tear the cover. You should wash your bedding, pillows, and clothing in hot water, 140 degrees Fahrenheit, or dry them in the dryer on the hottest setting for at least 20 minutes. If bed bugs have been found in your home, resist the urge to use household bug sprays or bombs. Bug bombs do not reach into the tiny cracks and crevices or into the clutter where bed bugs can hide. Common household products generally will not kill bed bugs and can cause them to spread and infest other parts of the home. Bed bugs are resistant to most commonly used pesticides. Using bug bombs and sprays on mattresses and in bedrooms will not kill the bed bugs or stop them from biting. It will only increase your exposure to more toxins. Repeated use of these products can pose health threats to you and your family. The insecticides that are most effective are those used by trained and licensed professionals and may require specialized equipment to apply. These are not readily available as household products and require state certification to purchase and use safely. Experienced companies know where to look for bed bugs, 
are schooled in proper techniques, and have an assortment of management tools at their disposal. Additional steps should include continuing to monitor after treatment to make sure the problem has been eliminated. Also, if you live in an apartment or other multifamily dwelling, it is helpful to alert the management so they can inspect any adjacent living quarters. Not all companies are experienced with bedbug IPM. Choose your PMP wisely. When choosing a pest control company, make sure the company meets all the legal requirements that qualify them to service your home, including a Pennsylvania Pesticide Applicator Certification, or registered technician card, a business license, and general liability insurance coverage. Also ask for a list of local references so you can learn about their past performance in treating bedbugs. In summary, if you find you have a bedbug problem at home, remember, the best solution is to use a professional, licensed pest control company. You can work with them to utilize solutions involving a multi-step approach known as IPM. Resist the urge to try and use over-the-counter bedbug pesticides, as they are toxic and generally ineffective against an infestation. If you would like more information, please go to our bedbug resources link at extension.psu.edu forward slash bedbug or contact us at either of these locations.